start. Two, one, boost ignition and lift off of the space shuttle Discovery, returning to the space station, paving the way for future missions beyond. NASA. When you first hear that, what do you think of? Do you think about the shuttle launches? Or maybe Neil Armstrong being the first man on the moon? NASA has so much more to it than most people know. Their program isn't all about space, but about aeronautics in general. Aeronautics has to do with all flying aircrafts. NASA tests the aircrafts we use every day to make sure they're safe and able to withhold the pressure of flying. I'm sure some people may not know what NASA is good for, but I'm here to enlighten you. To get the data that they want for whatever vehicle that they are testing in our wind tunnels. Those vehicles could be an airplane, it could be a rocket, you name it, we can test it. Customers come in and they want us to test a certain type of aircraft model and they have specific objectives. Sometimes they're very straightforward, most of the time they're, they're very complicated. Our job, mine and, and everybody else's here, starts really early before we even run a test in getting the information from customers and defining all the requirements and so forth that we have to, basically everything we have to do to, to set up the test and run the test. I want people to know more about NASA and what they have to offer. I think most people associate NASA with the space program, but really we do aerospace as well. We have a lot of wind tunnels and we do a lot of support to the aerospace industry and can't forget that first A in the NASA, the aerospace is here.